Yo, what's up everybody? In this video, I will be walking you through how to deposit funds and withdraw fiat on the Kraken exchange. Cryptocurrency exchanges are confusing at first, but we will go through together how to fund your account with both fiat and cryptocurrency and how to withdraw funds to your account step by step. So let's check it out. Before we jump into depositing and withdrawing money on Kraken, I wanna spend just a few seconds talking about what is Kraken and why you should use it. Kraken is not just a legendary sea monster, but Kraken is also also a, a legendary cryptocurrency exchange. You can buy, sell, trade, and learn about various cryptos on their exchange. They allow you to deposit and withdraw funds with multiple methods, which I'll show you in just a minute. And just a little history on Kraken and, and why I like it. So the platform was founded in 2011 and it is one of the oldest and most reliable cryptocurrency exchanges in the world. Kraken is you know, really focused on security and superb customer support, you simply will not find another exchange that is more secure and offers better support for their customers than Kraken. You can make big money on Kraken. They offer leverage, meaning that you can trade with more money than you have deposited. You can also short cryptocurrencies as well, which is a little more risky, but offers uh, more reward if you're, if you're successful. So there are a lot of really great things that I love about Kraken, and I'm an avid user of the Kraken Exchange myself. If you're watching this video and you're new to Kraken and you're as excited as I am about Kraken, but don't already have an account set up, it's extremely simple to go ahead and get started with one. All you need to do is click the link in the video description below to create an account and just follow the instructions to get you all set up. Full disclaimer, using the link in the video description does help support my channel and would be greatly appreciated. If you're looking for a quick guide on how to register and walk you through that process step by step, check out my video above on how to create an account on Kraken. All right, so with that out of the way, we are now logged into Kraken. We have an account set up and you can see right away that I already have some Bitcoin and US dollar in my account. Yours will probably be showing a zero balance if you, if you just got started. So how do you deposit funds into your account? Well, it's very easy. All you need to do is click the funding tab at the top of your screen. All right, and so this is the funding tab. You can see your total balance. I have two assets, Bitcoin and US dollar. You can see your limits. I'm uh, limited to a $100,000 deposit per day, as well as a $500,000 deposit per month. Likewise with withdrawals, I don't think I'll ever hit those limits, but it's nice to have a high limit as opposed to um, a small limit. One other quick uh, note on this is you will need to verify your account and provide Kraken with some information to increase your funding limits. And likewise for crypto, I have an unlimited daily deposit and monthly deposit, which, uh, which is pretty wild. So let's click back to fiat and you can see here account balances. There's two categories, fiat currencies as well as crypto assets. I am located in the United States and so I would want to fund my account with the US dollar fiat currency. And how do you do that? Just click on your respective uh, fiat currency and click deposit. And now we are ready to deposit our fiat currency or our US dollar. And there's a couple of different deposit methods if you click this drop down here. And really all of this is saying, you know, is there's a couple of different ways to fund your account. And the most common way is with a bank wire. You can do an MVB bank wire or a signature bank wire. I'm gonna go ahead and click MVB bank wire. And uh, you, you will want to read through this information, but really what we want here is the account name, the address, as well as the routing number and account number information. And I know online banking is uh, pretty popular now. You can all do this just on your bank app on your phone and just submit a wire and make sure you're sending it to the correct um, you know, information here. You may wanna send a small amount at first uh, as opposed to like a million dollars all at once just to see that you know, the information you're entering is correct. If you don't have online banking, then you may have to physically walk into a, a branch of a bank, which is probably less than ideal. I know I wouldn't wanna do that. So I would first see if you have the ability to uh, submit a bank wire via your online banking. And then as a backup, you can, uh, you know, walk into your branch and, you know, to speak to the teller and tell them what you're trying to do and make sure you bring this information with you. If you don't like the idea of submitting a bank wire, unfortunately, Kraken, you can't just enter your, uh, your debit card. So um, kind of unfortunate there. I don't know why that's the case. The good news is that you don't have to, you know, go through a bank wire to fund your account. You can fund your account with crypto. So let's go back to the funding page. 
And this is actually how I deposited funds onto Kraken. I just sent some Bitcoin to my wallet on Kraken. And so how do you do that? You go to your account balances here and just look for crypto assets and click deposit. I want to submit, uh, I want to deposit Bitcoin. So I'm going to, you know, select Bitcoin and click deposit. And so this is fairly simple. All you need to do is select this deposit address and Kraken offers you the ability to click the select button there to make sure you have every character highlighted. And then you just copy that. And then on your other exchange or your other wallet that you're trying to send crypto to your Kraken exchange, you would just access that wallet that you have, you know, out of outside of Kraken and submit this deposit address into that withdrawal address. And then again, I would recommend maybe sending a small amount of Bitcoin at first as opposed to the, the whole enchilada. So, um, you know, just to make sure that you're sending it to the right Bitcoin address. And then the Bitcoin network will take about 10 minutes. You know, sometimes it's a little bit longer to confirm your transaction. And then how do you check to see if you have successfully deposited funds onto Kraken? Just go back to the Kraken homepage and boom, you can see that you have successfully deposited funds onto Kraken. Now that we know how to deposit funds onto Kraken, you may be thinking, how do you withdraw funds? So it's very simple. Let's just go back to that funding tab at the top of the screen. And again, you know, we have fiat currencies and we also have our uh, crypto assets like Bitcoin. I want to withdraw US dollar into my bank account. So what I'm going to do instead of clicking deposit, I'm just going to click withdraw. And again, so Kraken will be funding your withdrawing your funds uh, via a bank wire. So I'm just going to click MBB bank wire. And then what you would do here is just enter your bank account details, you know, um, what you want to call your bank account, um, you know, what your bank is, you know, <laughs> actually called, as well as your routing number and account number. And again, all, you can find all of this on your online banking or if you don't have online banking, then you can walk into your branch as well. And then you just enter the amount of cryptocurrency that you would like to withdraw. And that's it. You would just click review withdraw and then make sure that the information is all correct and click submit. So what if you want to withdraw your, uh, not your fiat, but your cryptocurrency? Let's go back to the funding page and you would just find the crypto asset that you would like to withdraw. In this case, I want to withdraw Bitcoin. And so I click withdraw. And then what I want to do here is find the actual uh, Bitcoin address I would like to withdraw to. So like I mentioned earlier, um, you may have another wallet on another exchange outside of Kraken or another hosted wallet, you know, that may not be uh, on an exchange. And you just want to send that Bitcoin uh, to that address. You would find the deposit address on that other wallet and enter that here. It would be the withdrawal address on the Kraken exchange. And then you can save it as well for future reference. And then once you make sure that you're sending your crypto to the correct wallet address, you would just want to review the withdrawal, make sure all the details look good and click uh, submit. So now you know how to deposit and withdraw funds uh, to and from Kraken. If you are looking for a guide on Kraken and how to use all of its different features and functionality, check out the video at the top of your screen for a Kraken tutorial. I hope you found this video useful and I'd love to hear your thoughts and experiences with the Kraken exchange. I'm extremely active in my comments and if you have any questions, I am always happy to help answer them. If you like this video, please make sure you give it a thumbs up. And if you really liked it, make sure you click subscribe and best of luck to all of you going forward and thanks for watching.